by us committing to this at a level that I think it needs to be, I think you can take whatever volume you're doing now and multiply it by 0.5. 50% increase in volume, I believe that. So if you're doing 15, you're now at 22. If you're doing 12, you're now at 18. If you're doing 10, you're now at 15. I really think that, no, no, I know that by doing this at a level that we want to do it, we can increase by 50%. And after that, who knows? But my thought is this, for the next two months, can we commit to the hardest, most committed we've been? Because I used to say to the athletes at the beginning of the year, the most important time we'll spend together is the four and a half weeks we spend together before competition starts. I used to call it the pre-competition phase. The time we spend together before it starts, because once it starts, it's tough to get back on the wheel because you're playing games, you're not practicing, you're traveling, you've got the influence of all the stuff outside. So for the next two months, and you guys can email me whether you're in, I want to know that we'll work as hard as we can at this theory to give us the best opportunity to succeed. Now, this I'm thinking means maybe 7 a.m. training sessions before work starts. That would be working really hard, right? It may mean, it may mean a 115 one-on-one -on -one with Todd. But whatever it takes in order to do, we want to do it in order to get successful. I can't get you to buy into that. I just need to know if you want to expose yourself to get to a level that you think maybe, maybe I can't. But somewhere in your brain, you think maybe I can get to that level. All right? Because the very first person we have to convince that this stuff works is who? Ourselves. Ourselves. The very first person we need to convince is ourselves that this stuff works. Because the rest doesn't matter. If you don't believe 